In this video, I'll be showing you how to install a custom Redmine theme on your AWS Redmine instance. Let's get right into this. If you don't have Redmine installed, you can check the video in the description below and get Redmine installed. So once you have Redmine installed and you are logged in, you can come over to administration, settings, display, and on this tab, you can select the Redmine theme you want to use. So we have the default theme selected. I'm going to choose classic and save. So we have a new look here, and that's how to select a theme in Redmine. To install a custom theme, the first thing you need to do is find that theme. So let's go over to redmine.org, and you want to go to wiki, scroll down to documentation, other resources, themes, and Redmine theme list. So we have some themes here. We have some commercial ones and we want to look for some free themes. Let's open them in a new tab. And you can take a look at their screenshots here. Another website you can use is redmindthemes.org and let's go through some of the themes here. Open this in a new tab. Let's see how this looks. And I'll download this. So this opens the GitHub page. And yeah, we're good to go. The next thing you need to do is connect to your Redmine instance via SSH. So to do that, come over to go to your instance, then go to connect. On that SSH client, you can copy this code here. So I have this in my terminal here. And what you want to do is replace roots with Ubuntu. So the user is Ubuntu. So let's log in. I'll clear the screen and let's check what we have here. Let's go into the Redmine directory. Let's go to public. And let's go to themes. So you can see the theme list here, and it's the same as the list we have here. So the next thing we want to do is clone the theme we want to use here. So I'll copy this. I'm just going to go into my terminal and git clone, paste this here. And once this is done, we should have that theme installed as soon as we refresh the page. So let's select purple mine. We have Purple Mine installed and we have a new look here. Let's refresh our project page. And this looks really good. Let's try to install a new theme. So let's install this one. I'm going to clone this. So git clone. Let's paste this here. Let's go back to administration, settings, display, and let's select the new theme we just cloned. So we have another theme installed here. Let's refresh this. So I like how this looks, but I think I prefer the purple mine theme. So let's go back to purple mine. And yeah, guys, that's how you install a custom Redmine theme on your AWS Redmine instance. If you enjoyed this video and you learned something from this, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. If you have any questions about this, leave them in the comments below, and I'll see you in another video. Bye.